and welcome everybody. This is Rem Malloy, president and owner of ItalyForReal.com and we're here in the Amalfi Coast of Italy and today we're going to attempt to drive and teach you how to uh, navigate the Amalfi Coast Drive safely and securely uh, for fun or sport. So right now we are uh, just pulled off the A3 highway just outside of Ventre Sumare. And uh, if you were on the A3 and you were continuing past Naples uh, towards Salerno, um, you would exit at uh, Ventre Sumare, as you can see in front of us. And that is actually the uh, beginning of the Amalfi Coast Drive, or the end if you start in Sorrento. Uh, we're going to do it this way because uh, I think it's a lot more scenic, uh, more local towns along the way. So let's get going. Here we go. We're uh, getting ready to exit at uh, Ventre Sumari. There's our exit. Going to slow down a little bit. And exit off at Ventre Sumare, which I think is the uh, one of the end towns uh, of the Amalfi Coast. Uh, some great towns around here are, of course, Ventre Sumare, uh, Salerno, and a wonderful little town called Cava di Torreni. It's going to be the site of a, a church that turns uh, 1,000 years old in uh, 2011. So it's going to be quite the uh, uh, event there. And uh, here we are. This is Ventre Sumari. Very, very small town. Uh, one hotel. Now in the summertime, this area will be quite, uh, quite busy uh, with uh, all types of traffic and tourism. But uh, March is a wonderful time to teach you how to navigate this road properly and safely. Coming up on the beginning of the Amalfi Drive. And straight ahead is a map for the Amalfi Coast region. There it is right there. And this is the official start of the Amalfi Drive, the famous Amalfi Drive. We're gonna to try to get through the entire thing today and get you all the way to Sorrento. So as for a driver, if you are a, uh, a passionate driver, you will absolutely love driving this road. Um, it uh, is full of hairpin turns and uh, switchbacks and uh, straightaways and a little bit of everything for, uh, for the person who loves to drive. And here we go around another sharp turn. Gonna gain a little speed here. One of the things you'll see along this route uh, during the summer months is uh, olive, uh, I mean not olive, but uh, lemon groves uh, that grow along the uh, road here. And uh, wonderful, wonderful lemons, uh, large, football-sized lemons. Maybe we'll see a, uh, a stand or two along the way. Uh, one of the things you'll see, we've got one right up here, is that individual that uh, has just pulled off uh, to the side of the road to take a photo. There's a couple cars right there. Now, during the summertime, uh, that'll be uh, twice as many cars in that one spot, uh, probably uh, reducing the width of the road. Uh, in certain areas, so that's another thing to keep uh, keep track of. Uh, we are in Caserta, uh, C-E-T-A-R-A, -A. and uh, this is a wonderful little town. See the the, the terracotta covered dome uh, of the town here. Very small little beach area, uh, cafes, shops, maybe a supermarket or two. Maybe stop here and get yourself some prosciutto ham or some famous mozzarella di bufala or. Uh, or uh, mozzarella made from water buffalo. And you can see that sign right in front of me, it says Centro, with a mirror. Uh, that, uh, that sign designates the direction to the center of the town. Uh, that'll be uh, standard, uh, standard fare across Italy. Uh, and that mirror was very helpful to let me know that there was nobody. Uh, you wanna let people uh, go by. Uh, it's a nice courteous thing to do. And uh, we're continuing on. Got a couple of cars trying to enter. And uh, that was Certa, the town of Certa. Beautiful, beautiful views. And uh, there's somebody taking the curve nice and sharp, uh, cutting me off a little bit. Now we're going to Maiore, Maiore. We're just uh, transitioning into another coastal town. We got some nice driving here. 
and we get to pick up a little speed and uh, it says 50 kilometers but uh, we're gonna take it a little bit faster to enjoy these curves today and we're gonna slow down in this curve right here gonna take it nice and sharp and as you can see the uh, the road widens a little bit here's a blind curve we're gonna honk a little bit and pedal to the metal we're slowing down for this curve we're gonna honk let people know we're coming through and fast out we're straight on and one of the things that you will experience on this road are uh, large tourist buses. You know, uh, one of the things that you're going to want to do when you uh, uh, take the Amalfi Coast Drive here with a car is uh, you're going to want to learn to look at these mirrors. Here's one right there that just told me that little green car was coming around the corner. As we uh, head on here, we are um, getting ready to enter the town of Maiore. M-A-I-O-R-I. This is a perfect example of a, uh, another small secondary town on the Amalfi Coast, uh, which is just beautiful. Looks like they're building a hotel right here. It'll be another uh, great place to stop. I recommend uh, the Amalfi Jet Hydrofoil. Uh, the majority of these towns uh, to locations like Capri and Naples and Positano and Sorrento. Uh, there you can see the uh, we're coming into this little town. Uh, Minori and uh, it's got a couple of four-star hotels in it. Look at these terraces of lemons right ahead. Beautiful, beautiful. And usually the way these smaller secondary, secondary uh, towns work is uh, you'll do these switchbacks on the cliff edge and it will come down to sea level and straighten out as you can see. So here we are in the uh, center of the town and uh, please do abide by speed limit laws uh, when you are in uh, side of uh, city limits uh, because uh, it's going to be packed with pedestrians and uh, you want to make sure that you stay safe. There we go and we're going to make a quick uh, pass just to get around so you can widen out your view here. Great restaurants in this town, great cafes. You know I recommend you stop and have a espresso enjoy the view again this is uh, a great town to base out of because hotel prices will drop uh, quite a bit compared to some of the more popular towns like Positano or uh, Sorrento uh, so if you're on a budget you know the towns uh, the smaller secondary towns uh, of the Amalfi Coast, Maiori, Miori, uh, Ventri Sumari, those are going to be uh, great options for you because uh, prices will be uh, much, much lower than uh, the more popular uh, towns.